Right, what I've got here is an Airtronic e dispatcher. The, the D2, focus you fuck, which is actually running on a cheap Chinese controller, believe it or not. So that's, that's actually spinning in there, so you can see. There's the, um, the timer unit, the little thing that you fit on the wall. It's been running there for 27 minutes. The reason I've done this is because I inquired, this, this blew up the ECU in there, the little brain box exploded and I inquired about the price of a new one, it was nearly 300 quid, uh, which I, I mean it's ridiculous, I mean the one that's in there now, that cost me a tenner for that, that was 14 quid for that, so there's all the original Chinese, it's all connected through onto that there, so all the wires blah blah go through. So it is actually connected, it's not a car, it's not running off something else, it's not me trying to be silly, but there you go, that's the wire going in. You just go into that, that goes to that, and then that runs down through there, into that, and into that. You can see it's running, you can see the, uh, the air bubbles moving in the from the pump, so I'm not it's not just dead. It was dead, but now it's not. I mean, if you've got one of these and you've killed the ECU, which I know they're a bit temperamental, I do blow up. 300 quid for a controller? Nah, don't think so. 10 quid for a controller? That's more like it. So, I'm going to make a video about this tomorrow, another one, because I'm tired, I'm going to bed, I'm knackered, it's late, and I need a drink, and yeah, blah, blah. I will strip this open tomorrow and show you what I've had to do. There isn't a lot you've had to do at all, it's a simple, anybody could do it, I'd have thought. You've got to cut a few of the little plugs off inside the Chinese because the Eber Spatula and the Chinese are interchangeable, so you've got to do a bit of wiring in there. But it's nothing, you haven't got to change it, you've just got to put different plugs on or connect it to the actual board. And then these will run on the Chinese ECU, which will save people hundreds of pounds. I mean, 300 quid or a tenner? Which do you think? Yeah, exactly. I mean, this is the heater that it came out of. This thing here, this is the Chinese one, cost me 95 quid, I think it was, like eBay. It's a Tushengda, or whatever the fuck. I mean, it's brand new, it's been used a little bit. But I just sat there, I thought, oh, I wonder if that will work. Well, like I say, these are going to be changed, a few of these plugs, I mean, I've already cut that one off, just as an experiment, but that, that, they'll, just, they'll just push on, push onto the board, so that's not a problem. Anyway, like I say, what I'll do tomorrow is I'll open this up, this Airtronic, and I'll show you what I've done and how I've got it to work. But it's so simple, it could save save you. I mean, these things on eBay are dead ones, I mean, you could pick them up for not a lot. But I think even them, they're more expensive than the Chinese ones, but I've had this lying around. I mean, if you've got one of these and it don't work, you've blown the ECU, and you're crying about spending 300 quid plus on a controller. Yeah, you ain't got them anymore. These will run on the Chinese controllers. So anyway, for now, I'm going to bed. It's late. It's gone 11 o'clock. It's probably about quarter to 12 by now. So tomorrow, I'm going to make another video. I'll show you exactly what I've done and how to get these things back up and running. So for now, ta-da, catch you tomorrow.